This is the door card and uh, we want to take the door card off to get at the wing mirror and get the wing mirror off um, and in order to do that we need to take the speaker grill off we need to take the switch out we need to take the screws out there's a screw behind here there is a screw up under there as you can see and another one up under here um, and we can take this grill off as well and then the whole panel will come off T25 screws now out. Small flat head. Inside edge of the speaker. Pop it out. Teasing underneath, a little bit more teasing at the top, a bit more teasing around here. Perfect. It's the speaker grill off, and we can see the other screw within there. Screw in here, in the speaker. T25 again. It's a T25 out in here. T25 out. Yep. Now we can. Poppers all round. There we go. Oops. That's one of the screws away. Always make sure you find. The screws that you've got, keep to put them back in again, and then the door card comes off. Now, what we find that we've got in here, if we look just in here, is we have some wires hooking on there to the speaker, um, and we need to undo those wires to make sure that we don't break the speaker. And there we go. Now what we have is we have the hook for the door release. So what we need to do is we need to get that off as well. So simply unhook it. Let's go to a retaining clip here. And then you pass it down at night. And then that's it. We have another wiring harness here. to the ground gently pull the wire so the wiring harness comes up into here and it's a standard Audi release it should be over Screwdriver. 
go. Comes back, the cable comes out, and that's it. The door card has now been released from the car. Now we can strip the door card down in a future video to show you how all the components come off the door card itself. Now we have the inside of the door. You've got the um, the window mechanism here. You've got the speaker. Now the speakers always seem to get grime from this. These are the famous bits that disintegrate, causing the door click, which I think we've got here. So they can come off as well at a future point. We need to get those and salvage those as well. And um, present. That. So, what we're aiming to do today is we're aiming to get the wing mirror. So this is not only the control unit for the motor for the um, window, it is also the door control unit which controls the mirror. Um, hence why we've got the cable in here as well. So let's pop that cable out. There we go. And we've got the tabs that go all the way along that clip the mirror in. Now, it's a bit haphazard getting these things off, but we will try our, our level best. And this is the interesting part, where we can take this off here, along with this, uh, let's get the trim to release. Just pull it from this side here and then it releases. And then lift up, out, and that's this part off. And then we have a very large piece of foam, which is required to stop you getting drafts when it makes the car. And then we have a bolt here, a large one and a small one. It's like a locating one. And then we'll just confirm which size we need to be able to release this, it looks like a reasonably chunky one. So the six. It's not a six. So let's check again. It's a start. So what are we thinking? I'm thinking I'm going to go for a T40. T40. And it could be a T40, but we're going to try a T45. T45 it is. It is definitely a T45. So. to be damaged and we're ready to take the mirror off pass the cable gently through Perfect condition. Yes. 
and then that's us effectively ready to ship it off. Let's move on. All ready to go. As we strip down the door, we have other parts that we find that can be of use to remove, such as the speaker itself. See the damage there onto the aluminium inner trim from here, and this will be removed at some later stage as well. So we find we have the requirement for the crosshead screwdriver. new owner, along with the grill, screws back in, and we no need for them now, oops, the whole door wiring harness can be removed from here, and fed back through if the harness was in any use. here. Aluminium, sorry. So let's see if we're on a T27. We are. T27. T27. are not T27. These are T25. T25. see 
that it is clearly stuck to this stuff. And that's in effect what we're peeling it off. There we go.